Hey everybody, today I'm going to show you how to make a nutmeg and almond custard pie. Oh yeah, delicious. Well first thing you do is get you out a pie plate, plate and uh, I use those pre-made pie crust. Just thaw them out, okay? Lay them over there. Here's a quarter cup of almonds. Chopping them babies up, okay? Need to chop your almonds up. Now that, what was just put in there was one cup, I mean one stick of melted butter and then sugar, uh, buttermilk, eggs, vanilla, a little bit of nutmeg, and I'll put all those down below for y'all so you can tell. But once you get them all in there, you gotta hand mix this pie, okay? Now, those nuts, I think, are the last things I'm gonna put in there. So what you do is you get your spatula out, okay? And we're gonna take our spatula and just beat the fire out of this, but not too hard, you know what I'm saying? Don't wanna rough it up. You just wanna kinda scare it a little bit. Just kind of mix her up there real good. And when you get her kind of mixed up in there, then you add your two eggs that I forgot a while ago. <laughs> but it don't matter. It ain't in the oven yet, so you can still put them in there and stir it up. Okay? Got to have the eggs in there. Make sure you get them real well incorporated. And that is your pie. It's just beautiful. Okay? Now, you want to get your dough, I mean your pie crust out, and pour it all in there. All right, and then you have your 400 degrees preheated oven. We're gonna bake this pie at 400 degrees for about 15 minutes. And then we're gonna lower our heat to 350 and we're gonna cook it for another 45 minutes, okay? Now, one thing you need to do if you let your pie crust do like I have, I just let mine fall because I like the natural look of it. You know, you can prank it and preach it and make all those little crepes around it if you want to, but you still need to add your foil to the crust on the outside because it's going to be in the oven at 400 degrees, okay? Now, I'm going to sprinkle a little nutmeg on top of it, just like so, and I'm going to take it and put it in a 400 degree oven, but then you'll see that I had to come back in because I forgot, Smooth forgot about the foil, okay? So put her in the oven, but make sure to foil it up prior to putting it in the oven. And that's what it looks like once you get your foil on it, okay? Shove her on in the oven there, and after you've cooked it, and you lowered your heat to 350 for 45 minutes, pull her out, and there's what you should have. A beautiful, beautiful nutmeg and almond pie. And all that's left to do now is cut it and serve it, you know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, baby. All right, y'all. Uh, I appreciate you watching my videos. I truly do. Look how beautiful that is. Oh yeah, delicious. I truly do appreciate all you subscribers and I hope that you make this little recipe. It's easy. Now, that piece looks like hell, don't it? I just not a good pie cutter person. My wife tells me anyway. Well, folks, y'all have a great day. Beautiful weekend coming up, I hear. And I hope you get out and enjoy it. Bye.